Okay. And that right there would be the power valves. As you can see, that goes down to the intake manifold. Right behind it is the fuel pressure regulator. That gets power, gets vacuum source from this T right here, which also goes up into that area there and feeds that white line, which feeds my boost gauge and vacuum gauge. That T from there then also goes down to here, T's into that, and one of them reads, and that's where the source is right there, the manifold. And then the one underneath goes to the other side and actually plugs into underneath the throttle body. I assume that's the before plate. I can't remember which one at this moment. Uh, that's normally where the EVAP canister would go, bolted between the brake master and the fuel filter, which is not there, obviously. Never mind my clutch reservoir being broken. Um, this is my vacuum source for my booster. Now, over here is my blow-off. And this vacuum line is all the way back. I had to fit it to a larger hose so there's an adapter. And it actually is that line right there, and it's direct manifold pressure, so that way it always works. Um, this is my idle air control I pointed out previously in the other, other video about my pipes. And yeah, that's it. I once had air conditioning down in there. I don't have that anymore. But as you can see, uh, because I don't have the power valves hooked up, that eliminates a large, large section of vacuum lines. So, uh, so there you go. PCV system. <laughs> okay then.